Bring the cart to the dog. <laughs> stay, right, stay put, Shauna. Okay. Put, well, put the legs. Hey, babe. There you go. Leg in each hole. Center the cart under the dog. You have to bring it up and around. There you go. Close it over. There you go. Good girl. There you go. It's a beautiful Shauna. It's a Rhodesian Ridgeback. She has DM. She was once an agility dog. And she's very proud, very well trained. And she thinks she's getting along quite well without her. Thank you very much. <laughs> Did you get her tail out? Oh. Check her tail. There you go. But we're telling her how beautiful she looks in her cart. And mom is uh, baiting her with treats. So she's going <laughs> to do it just fine. That looks good. So you want to tighten that up a little bit in the front. Hi. There you go. You want to have two inches, two fingers worth of slack. There you go so that when she's walking, she's pulling against it, but you want her to back to get a nice stretch. That's good. Okay. Okay. There you go. There you go. You're looking good. Come on. Let's go walk down the hill again. Come on. Come on, Sean. Come on, Sean. Where's those treats, Mom? I can't see the treats. Where are those treats go? I know where those treats are. <gasps> yeah, pretty girl. You're such a pretty girl. There you go. There you go. There you go. Good job. There you go. There you go. Good girl. She does seem to walk much better. Yeah. Even since last. Absolutely. Well, you know, having enough space in the saddle to move her legs makes all the difference in the world. Shauna came here with a used cart that was too tight in the rump, so we found another used cart that we were able to refurbish for her. And it had the right size saddle. There she goes. So she's doing really well. She's going to adapt to this quite nicely. Good girl.